everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm making you guys some creamed corn and if you guys want to know how to make this please hit that subscribe button and watch me cook. Now this video is going to be super short because this is very very easy to make and these are just the basic ingredients that I'm using. There are other ingredients that you can use and I'll let you guys know along the way but we're just going to get started here. What I have here is about 16 ounces of corn which is about two cans worth. And I'm also going to be using a whole entire stick of butter, which is half a cup of butter, as well as some Splenda, one tablespoon for me, you guys can use sugar if you'd like, half a cup of milk, as well as four ounces of cream cheese. And the cream cheese is only half of the full fatty, full flavored kind of cream cheese. And that's it. Add your salt and pepper to it. We're gonna let it all come to a boil, and then we're gonna let it slowly simmer and cook until everything is melted and nicely combined. And all I'm gonna do as this is boiling is start stirring things around, moving it, trying to help break it up and let it dissolve inside of the pot all together. And from this point, all you have to do is just basically continue watching this pot, which only takes like, I believe, what, five minutes or so, that's it. Depending on your stove top, how hot everything gets, how fast everything will boil. And I'm just gonna continue stirring this until I see that there is no more butter left inside of my pot and all the cream cheese has melted. This will thicken as you put it out on the table and let it sit there. If you feel like this is still too runny for you for some reason, it will thicken again, but in just in case here, you can add two tablespoons of flour. Additional optional items that you could add, onions, bacon, garlic, whatever you prefer, and then just serve it in a bowl, sprinkle some parsley on top of it for color, and that's it. If you guys like this recipe, please hit that subscribe button, like it, share it, and till the next meal, thank you for watching. Watch me cook.